he knew exactly what the vision for this was. He executed it. It was impossible to not have it be an offensive nightmare of a movie. <laughs> and 90% of my black friends are like, dude, that was great. <laughs> Robert Darity Jr. don't give up. This video is brought to you by the Austin Tatum Store. The Austin Tatum Store. <laughs> Look at this big old head. <laughs> Make sure you go to Tatum Store, the Austin Tatum Store, and get you one of these hats today. All you have to do, you can either go to the hat section or you can go to new releases. Click on the extra button to new releases, but you know you want to cop one of these. But go down to new releases. Uh, get you one of these noggin hats. They're the hats that look just like this. This is the one I have on. We actually have one in camo. I think we sold out, but we'll restock if you hit notify me made available. But I'm going to give you 25% off these hats. 25% off these hats. My big hat, you'll get 25% off. Discount code my big hat. You will get uh, 25% off the hats. Let me take this thing off for my neck pop. It's real comfortable, though. Got a good insert on the inside. Like and subscribe to the channel. Y'all already know what to do. Let's talk about Robert Downing Jr. and Tropic Thunder. The funny thing is, and, I, and I've been wanting to make a video about this, and I know everybody know what Tropic Thunder is. It's the most epic movie that would never exist today in America. People could not fathom how Robert Downing Jr. was a black man, literally blackface, the whole movie. But let me let you listen to what he had to say about it. And I thought it was hilarious. Him on Joe Rogan. And then I'm going to play a clip from the iconic movie Tropic Thunder. So you can kind of see what that movie is about if you're too young to have seen it. Let me go to my boy Joe Rogan. Uh, do you think that you could do Tropic Thunder today? Oh, you could do it. <laughs> <laughs> when Ben called and said, hey, I'm doing this thing. And, you know, and I'll do that after Iron Man. And then I started thinking, this is a terrible idea. <laughs> Wait, wait a minute. And then I thought, well, hold on, dude. Where is your heart? And my heart is, A, I get to, I get to be black for a summer in my mind. <laughs> so there's something in it for me. It was impossible to not have it be an offensive nightmare of a movie. 90% of my black friends are like, dude, that was great. <laughs> <laughs> All the heat got deflected to Ben and Simple Jack. Yeah. That's what people were pissed off about. And I go, <laughs> whew, great. Like My mother was horrified. <laughs> really? Bobby, I am telling you, I have a bad feeling about this. <laughs> Joe, Rogan, Joe Rogan made me laugh listening to it. But I want you guys to see um, a little clip of Tropic Thunder in case you are too young to remember the movie and you haven't seen any parts of the movie it is the the, the most epic display of comedy in my opinion with no reservation as you've ever seen so we're gonna we're gonna play that clip Let, let's watch tropic thunder together roll the clip dang cook river yes sir how do you know that are you sure only one way to find out dude let's go yeah i'm not feeling so good right now Seriously, my skin hurts. Milk from the peanut gallery. Into the water, ladies. No, 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 man. Let me take a look at that map real quick. That's Robert Downey Jr. <laughs> he look, hey, hey, y'all got to be honest. He did a good job, though. He did a good job. Because some of y'all, if y'all didn't know the context of this, you would have probably thought that that was a black man. I, I honestly, I, I, maybe, maybe I'm wrong. Why is everybody all obsessed with the map? Because we're tired of being your tram donkeys. Acting like you some one man GPS? God, we lost. We super lost, man. Tell him, McCluskey. Tell him what time it is. I don't believe you, people. Huh. What do you mean, you people? What do you mean, you people? Huh? I, I think what uh, Tug oh, means is you no, people. No, look at his eyes, man. You people. Exactly. Look at that beady. Why are you talking to me? I gotta get back to the shelter. Chill, all right? <laughs> Just chill it. Now, let's go get those Viet Congs. Viet Cong! What? It's Viet Cong. There's no S. It's already plural. You wouldn't say Chinese. <laughs> so if y'all haven't seen Tropic Thunder, I don't, I don't know. They should probably pay me to advertise Tropic, Tropic, 
Tropic Thunder. I want to say Chocolate Thunder. But you should go check it out if you haven't seen it. A hilarious movie. Robert Downey Jr. plays the black man. Uh, and Ben Stiller, you know, he, he was amazing as well. I think that's his name, Ben Stiller. He was amazing as well. And then Jack Black. And, and a whole bunch of other people who you may see as famous today that played in the movie. Um, there's so many actors in that movie that, that were epic, absolutely epic. And the left wants them to be canceled because Robert Downey Jr., uh, Downey Jr. had was they called blackface. I mean, I don't even think that was blackface. He was a black man. But they said he was doing blackface, so they want them to counsel. Um, ben Stiller said, I ain't apologizing for nothing. And you already heard what Robert Downey Jr. said, and I thought that was actually hilarious, is that it, there's no need to apologize for this. It was comedy. It was good comedy. It was fun comedy. And, and it's nothing wrong. And then right after that, they made white chicks. So, so you got the, the, the Damien, I want to say Winans, but it's not Winans, is it? Waynes, Damian Waynes. I'm thinking of Marvin Winans. You got the Waynes brothers playing white chicks, turning into white girls. I, I, and uh, what's the name was one too? Uh, or he was in the movie. Uh, what's his name? Big, big old strong dude. I forget his name. But he was in the movie as well. They playing white chicks. So it's no problem if black people are dressing up and playing stereotypical white girls. But it's weird if a, a white man dressed up as a black man. I, I just think that that's foolish. I think it's foolery. And I think that... Um, it shouldn't be an issue whatsoever. I would pull this up, but I can't see the screen. Let me see. Okay, there you go. Here, here's the uh, the tweet. I'm gonna I'm gonna enlarge it real quick. Let's see, so you can see it. There you go. So Ben Stiller says here, here right here on the screen. It says, "I'm not apologizing for Tropic Thunder. Um, don't know who told you that. <laughs> it's always been a controversial movie since uh, when we when we opened. Proud of it." And the work everybody did on it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. But these woke folks are just out of their mind, out of control. Anyway, tell me what you think about Tropic Thunder. Tell me what you think about the woke mob coming out against them. And is it wrong for Robert Downey Jr. to play a black man in a movie, a comedy movie? Y'all already know what to do. See you on the next one. I'm out. Hey, if you enjoyed this video, I put out three videos a day. So make sure you go to the uh, playlist that says new video and watch more videos. Subscribe to this channel. Let's go, baby.